today we are doing Zelda Breath of the Wild's Shodan 2 Shrine in the Gerudo region. What's up YouTube, I'm Kat from KK Jinx Gaming, gaming for fun. And today, I'm gonna show you how to complete this shrine. Watch to the end to get all of the chests. This shrine is located just northwest of Gerudo Tower, close to the Yiga Clan hideout. It is easy as seen at night, but it's not necessary to complete. I made it nighttime just because it's prettier. And although you do have to solve a simple riddle to access this shrine, it's not actually a shrine quest. There is a stone tablet over here, and if you click on it and read the tablet, it says, if you seek power untold, offer a shining blue stone. And you can see the shining blue ore deposits around the shrine, so we can guess that the shining blue stone is a luminous stone. Go ahead and use a stone smasher or a sledgehammer or even your remote bombs would do the trick to break these ores open and grab these luminous stones. Go ahead and grab one and go ahead and place that on the altar. And that reveals the dun 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 show down to shrine. Let's go right up to the shrine terminal and then let's go right inside. This shrine is called Two Bombs. First thing you may notice is two locked doors and some wooden crates. Throw a remote bomb at the wooden crates. Coming into this room, we can see a big giant thing in the middle with a thing on top. And we'll get to that, but let's first come around the back side because there is a chest there waiting for us. Let's open it up to reveal a dun 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 silver rupee. Stuff that in your pouch and let's come back around to the front. And when this launcher is down, place a square remote bomb on it and move off of it before it launches. When it does launch and your bomb reaches the less than solid part of the structure, go ahead and detonate that remote bomb. If timed correctly, this will hit a switch inside that thingy and this will open one of those locked doors from the main area. Let's head that way. In here we have a similar setup and we are going to approach it in the same way. So let's first come around to the backside. But this time it's a switch instead of a chest but don't hit the switch. We want to place a round bomb on the floor next to it. Don't detonate the round bomb yet. Come back around to the front and place a square bomb on the launch pad. Don't detonate that yet. And now is where we've got to be quick. First, detonate the round bomb and then detonate your square bomb. If timed correctly, this will hit another switch that's inside that thingy and this will open the other locked door in the main area. Let's head that way. In this room, pay close attention because it has to be done in the right order for best results. Take a launcher, I like the left side, and place a square bomb on the launcher when the launcher is in the down position, but make sure to allow yourself enough time to hop off of it before it launches. The square bomb will land in the middle basket. Leave it there for now, do not detonate. Pull out a round bomb and place it in the launcher just like you did with the square bomb. Do not detonate. And that's gonna get tossed back and forth for a little while, and that's fine. And then we're gonna come over here to this launch pad and stand on it. Wait until the round bomb is on either far side and nowhere near the middle basket, then detonate your square bomb. That is gonna go ahead and lift us up to a solid platform. Go ahead and move on to set a solid platform, and when the round bomb is in the middle by the basket, go ahead and detonate it, and that's gonna hit the switch one more time, unlocking this door behind you. And now all that's left to do is talk to the monk, and don't forget to check your map. Yeah, buddy, we got all the chests. That's it, boys and girls, you're all done. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and be sure to punch that bell square in its face so you don't miss any content released. This is KK Jinx, over and out.